Uh, describe a good memory of eating food. I would say um, I have lots of good memories of getting together with um, girlfriends, actually, that we just have soup and salad and wine and water and bread and maybe some chocolate for dessert. And it's awesome. I think my favorite business is the co-op, the Mississippi Market co-op. And why is that? I, because I can usually depend on really nice produce and um, they have a lot of local things. Uh, they have, yeah, they, I don't get everything there, but I like their meat. Um, so I would say, I go to a lot of places. I go to Costco for okay. meat too. I um, also go to Whole Foods. I go to Lund's in my neighborhood. I go to Trader Joe's. That's, so, that's one of my favorites. Yeah, so all over. But mainly I would say the co-op. Oh, <laughs> okay. That, that's good. You killed two birds with one stone. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so what does um, your community, what, does, what food does your community have enough of or not or too much of? Not enough of, I'm sorry, or too much of? Um, well, I feel like my community has an abundance of food, but I do feel like it's harder to get affordable fresh food in the winter season. So I would say that. How would you use food to bring people together? Well, who doesn't like to eat a meal? I mean, this. <laughs> um, I love gatherings with food in, in them. And, uh, so, um, yeah. is there any last words you would like to say? Last words. <laughs> um, just, I'm really happy to be here tonight. I think it's exciting, and I, these bowls are so beautiful. And Aki said to find one that spoke to me, and it's like they're all speaking to me. So. Oh, okay. <laughs> And so, say your name one more time. Megan Finney. All right. Thank you so much. Thanks, Sharonda. <laughs>